And now live from Shepherd's Bush, the BBC presents The Life and Times of Luis Munoz. What we're going to do is take a step back, we're going to take a step forward, and we're going to take a step all the way around in a circle and talk about Mr. Luis Munoz. Let's start from the beginning. Camels. Yes, we've all seen them. And yes, we've all liked to take a ride on them. Egypt. Hot, dry, sandy. This is where our story begins with Mr. Luis Munoz. He was born on a camel in the middle of the Egyptian desert in 1984. It was a hot day. They had no water. But this miracle baby was born under the rarest of circumstances. Four years later, his family decided to move the family to Villa del Mar, Valparaiso, Chile. It was a rough start. They ate shoes and bread. They didn't really have much money for anything other than going to the pub and watching soccer games. In this rare and very dated recording, you will hear the first hit single that Luis Munoz ever recorded as a teenager in Chile. That wonderful summer, that song was played all over the Chilean airwaves. It was breaking all the records and all the barriers. Young mothers had something to look up to. They knew how to tell their babies that they loved them. Single men yearned for women to sing it to. Everything was fine. Under the fake name Johnny Gay, Luis Munoz had a hit. Later that year, Luis came upon an old collaboration partner that he used to make music with back in Egypt. It was old Stalkerize McGee, later to be known as Matt Bust. They got together and formed a band, Don't You Wanna Rub My Beard On Me? The band had little to no success, but one hit in the summer of 1986. Bedroom floor in a pool 